Hello guys, good afternoon. Welcome to another lecture. It's been a while. Alright, um, I've been hammering on the point that I wanted to teach you guys how to do keyword research. Get thousands and hundreds of keywords free. Yes, you heard me right, free. Or with a little cost. Now I'm going to explain what I mean with a little cost. This is one of my keywords and um, research routine. Most of the times I use this to get as many low competition keywords as I can. Alright, in this tutorial, we will be making use of two tools, free tools, to gather as much keywords as we can on a particular topic or niche. Alright, we'll be talking about a tool. A popular SEO tool, keywords everywhere. Keywords everywhere. Right? Is a Chrome extension. Is a Chrome extension. I don't know if it works with a Mozilla or other browsers, but I use Chrome browser predominantly. So it's a Chrome extension. I shall also leave a link on the description of this video in case you want to get these two. I think with, at le with as little as 5,000 Naira, you can get enough credit that will serve you for one full year. Yes, for one full year, but that's by the way. So another tool I'm going, we're going to use is, the most important one, is a SEO Minion, or Minion as the case may be. These are free two free Chrome extensions. They are free, you just install them on your Chrome, click by install, I open it the Chrome extension okay both of them are Chrome extension please you can only use this with system it doesn't work with phone right so you install it on your Chrome extension all right this particular tool SEO minion is used to harvest keywords especially keywords from Google people also ask what do I mean by people also ask Look at it here. People also ask PAA. You can get good keywords, low competition keywords with volume that you can rank here. So what this tool does is it scrapes Google's uh, um, database to get the keywords people are asking on Google, as many as many of them on a particular topic. Right now, let's assume our topic is keywords everywhere, right? And then every suggestion here will contain keywords everywhere what is keywords everywhere can i use keywords everywhere for free how do keywords work with work everywhere is keyword everywhere good so for a practical example like i told you i'm going to use this tool to script keywords and then i'll explain how it does and then i will use um my keywords everywhere extension here my keywords everywhere. i will use it to check for um, the keywords search volume CPC competition and trends as you can see on the right hand side all right I already have these two installed in my crew okay let's assume that I want to search for topics on blender for smoothies this is a very good niche for those that this is a very good niche I'm not going to go in depth with this niche but I'm just going to scrape some keywords so I'm looking for keywords I write on blender for smoothies smoothies as the case may be this particular keyword now three words it has an estimated 90 90 500 monthly so i want to get some keywords long tail keywords from this term all right as you can see from a uh, google auto complete you can see other keywords on google to complete best cheap blender for smoothies best durable blender all of them has such volume now this is where keywords everywhere comes into place personally i use it for one harvesting keywords secondly for search volume estimation all right um when it comes to search volume estimation i think keywords everywhere is closer to what google suggests because they actually pick these things from google itself all right so um without further ado let's get into work now look at that seo minion i was talking about once you install it and you <clears throat> you activate it you activate the extension to show 
you can now see it at your uh, when you go to <coughs> your Google page you can find it at the, the sidebar all right <coughs> I'm going to explain some things we are going to use what we call organic result now these are lists 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 I'm only after PAA which means people also ask all right now this two has some different levels when you when it say PAA two levels five seconds it means you can scrape in five seconds how many keywords can these two scrape from this place in five seconds all right how many how many keywords can each script now let's run a fast one um they also have 10 seconds now let me use 10 seconds once you select paa three levels 10 seconds you click go so it's we start expanding on people also ask and extracting keywords that have these terms in it from here i can get low competition keywords i can get question based keywords that people are actually looking for problems people are trying to solve all right 15 clicks okay okay as you can see in 10 seconds it got 47 keywords and then it downloaded automatically as a um, excel sheet so let me open it and see the keywords that have been script all right okay all right in 10 seconds we were able to get 48 keywords look at them here 48 keywords from people also ask 48 keywords we can rent on 48 keywords all right i'm going to copy it for later use i just copy this now coming back to this place you will see that in 10 seconds it's it's got 47 keywords now when you check other levels we have level 4 30 seconds level 5 2 minutes uh, level 6 10 minutes level 7 60 minutes level 8 6 hours normally i use this is hours Maybe in the night, I just put it, it, is, it starts scraping for me, then I go to bed. Maybe when I wake up, it could have gotten up to thousands of keywords that I can start sorting out. Right? Okay, you can experiment. Click on any of the time, click go. Once the time elapses, it downloads the keywords automatically on an Excel sheet. You can sort it out. Now, what do I mean by sorting out? This is where keywords everywhere come into play here. So I have keywords everywhere already. I'll click on it. I will go to bulk, bulk keywords data. Now you remember I copied these keywords. So I want to separate them from either those that have traffic, sorry, those that have search volume or low competition. So I just paste it here around 48 keywords and then I'll click on get metric. I shall leave my referral link on keywords everywhere. One of the advantages of, of using a referral link is you get 20% 20% more credits on top of the one you already have it's cheap and you can buy it with your naira card or us card it's cheap you can get you can get credit that can last you for a year 10 dollars which should be around 5000 all right we have so many keywords here some of them are zero competition now for the fact that this thing is zero competition does not mean that people are not searching for it no this zero competition in actual sense or practical sense could be almost up to 500 or a thousand views monthly so don't ever neglect zero competition keywords and do not do don't mind this 0.0, .0 cpc people are searching for blender for smoothies it means it has high cpc because it's a product and advertisers are advertising this product so now um i want to use these keywords everywhere to filter this these keywords i want to get the keywords that have search volume of at least 10 at least 10 so i'll go to this place minimum and click 10 and then i'll just click outside now it has filtered and provided keywords that has at least 10 volumes monthly a fruit smoothie is good for you why does my blender not blend fruit frozen fruit all right most of these keywords are low competition you can rank rank them on new sites with good articles can rank them now you can imagine from 47 that we submitted 
we are able to filter around 11 that has such volume so if you're the type of blogger that always go for keywords that has such volume because i know some bloggers that don't for example dr dr abbas toriola is one of a is a great guy he's a great man in this blogging industry in nigeria yes one of his sites you can go to his site web income plus it's like a good mind you learn many things there so he does not go for zero competition keywords he actually go for at least 10 above right but me i always go for zero to how many to any number so i like going so far if i see the if i see if i see a keyword and i feel that it has potential even if it is zero 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 i will write on it and most of the times every time i always get visitors i get sales imagine that i'm i'm writing on a niche about them um, blenders can get i can get access of them all right so this way you can get thousands of keywords to write on some people complain that ah how can i see 100 keywords to write on this way for example let me assume that i have let me filter by 10 let me filter that by 10 Filter. Let me filter by 10. Okay, I don't know why it's not filtering. However, I could, if, I, if I'm done filtering, I could copy all of them. If I click copy, it copies all of them, or I download them as an Excel. I like downloading, downloading them as an Excel file. It will come to my system, just download them, it will download automatically. Understand? So, with this, you can run different different um different terms smoothie machine smoothie which maybe if your niche is about smoothies smoothies let me see an estimated volume smoothies has an estimated volume of um coming of 1.5 million monthly so imagine that you are writing on smoothies and then you have them um, about 100 keywords giving you a about 100k monthly views you know you're in you're in big money all right so with these two tools you can get as many keywords as you can right now the advantage of um keywords everywhere here in this sense in this particular tutorial is to know if some of these keywords they have an estimated search volume all right keywords everywhere is you can use it for free the free version does not give you uh, estimated volume or CPC estimate. It doesn't. But if you get and you can you can use it for free. It it is it can you can also use it to get plenty keywords. It, it gives you keywords related keywords as many of them, all right? And then anyone you click, it expands on it. If I click on banana smoothie, oh, I hate these things. I hate this things. I hate this things. All right, banana smoothie. If you click on banana smoothie, this is another keyword under smoothie. So you see, it will bring keywords that contain banana smoothie, different of them. So with these two, you can get keyword ideas related keywords to write on most times i i pick one keyword to write on and i end up writing up to 10 just from keywords everywhere so now the the advantage of having the pro let me not call it pro the advantage of having um having the paid version of these two is that it will give you estimated volume the trend always want to go with trending topic right it's as as cheap as you can get as cheap as ten dollar uh, you can buy with your Naira card. I used GT Mastercard to buy. I buy around five thousand for hundred thousand credits. Yes, hundred thousand credits, and I've been using it. It has not finished. So you can, I'll drop a link on the bio. Sorry, on the description of this video, which you can use to get. Um, if you want to buy the, if you want to buy credits on keywords everywhere, you use my link. I get twenty percent credit. You get twenty percent on top of your own credit also. All right this too is is if you're a blogger and you mean business 
don't ignore keywords everywhere i shall drop the link to both the two tools seo minion is free you don't need to pay for anything all right in my next lecture i'm going to also show you another way of getting unlimited keywords faster right thank you for your time please don't fail to subscribe share invite your friends thank you very much and have a nice day